Hey guys, so today we're going to try a new refrigerator that's a different shape than the standard refrigerators. And this one's going to be tall and narrow, and I think it should fit perfectly between my two front seats. So let's give it a shot. All right, as you can see, this is the AB15 set power model and it says mobile freezer but of course it's a refrigerator also you don't have to make it so cold that it's a freezer that's an option if you do want to set it to freezer so let's take a look at what it looks like on the inside All right, I think it looks pretty good. Look at this. There's a strap if you want to use a strap. Let's take a look around. So this will be the front side, plug, fan. Here's the back side. And of course it opens up in the middle like that because it's because you want to put it in between your two front seats. Let's see what else it comes with. All right, so it comes with a strap. So if you want to, you know, carry it around your shoulders, you can do that too. It's pretty much, it's that flexible, you know, over your shoulders. If you're traveling somewhere. Let's see, what else is this? Huh. I think this is an ice maker. Look at that. That that looks pretty cool. You put it in water on the top and uh huh. Wow, that's pretty cool. So you can adjust the size of the ice that you want to make. You can open this and it'll make little ball ice if that's what you want. Or if you want to make a big ice pack, you can open it up, fill it up with water and freeze it. And close it back up. That's pretty cool. I've never seen that. Okay. That. Here's the power adapters. All right, so this is the one, the power brick for your house if you want to plug it into your outlet. And this is where I'll be plugging it for the most part. It's going to be the cigarette lighter, okay? All right, looking inside, you can see it's pretty deep. It's not a huge refrigerator, but there's also another section right here. Um, for water bottles and things like that if you want to uh, have your water bottles right here So that's pretty cool Here's the manual Pretty straightforward. It's a refrigerator So let's see how well it fits in the car. All right, so here in my Sienna I already took out the center console. So I have a empty spot right here. That's gonna be perfect for that refrigerator, so let's give it a shot. All right, look at that. That fits really well, and it looks really nice. It looks like it belongs. Let's take a closer look at it. So it'll open up like that. Here it sits in between the two seats. Fits perfectly. You don't have to install or anything like that. Let's plug it in, see what it sounds like, and let's look at the display. All right, so let's give it a shot. So I'm just going to plug it in my cigarette lighter. Plug it in right there. OK. 
Okay. All right. All right, to, so to set the temperature, you just push up or down. And I figure I'll, I'd like it probably one or two degrees above zero. Let's see. Oh, it only goes in odd numbers. <laughs> so let's go one above zero. And my motor is on because I need the power for the um, for the refrigerator. But it's actually really quiet. I, I could barely hear it with the motor on. You see, turn off the motor. It's actually a really quiet device. So, you know, here's your armrest. Got your refrigerator. There's even a, a little light in there. Pretty cool. And you could have a cold drink right here as you're driving. Open it up, get your cold drink, put it back down. So that's pretty cool. So I know what you guys might be thinking right now. I have my center console removed, so it looks great and, and all that. But what if you don't want to remove the original center console and you want to put this on top? So let's give that a shot. Let's put the center console back on and see what it looks like with that. All right, so I got that center console back in. I, I didn't screw it back in and I didn't put the back part, but this is just what it would look like. So let's see what how this would fit. So even if you wanted to leave your old center console and you just wanted a refrigerator that doesn't take up the space in the back of your car, this just might be a good solution for you. It's not so high that you can't get to it. It, it is a little high. Uh, you know, it's, look, if you want to use it as an armrest at this point, it's probably higher than your, your window. So if you like putting your arms out the window, this is probably a little bit higher than that if you use that. But for me, I think I think using it as the, instead of the center console is just perfect. The shape, it's out of the way. You could actually still climb in and out of the back. So this might be a good option for you if you're looking for a refrigerator that fits right here in the middle that's not taking up the space in the back.